Hello everybody, welcome back to some more Lemmings World Tour! We only have, if memory serves, 10 levels left in the Legend rank. Am I- do I have that right? I think that's only 10 levels left. Maybe I'm wrong, maybe I'm completely and utterly wrong about that. Nope, 10 levels left! We're on level 31 of the Legend rank, so it's gonna be top 10 hardest levels up next, maybe? We'll see. It's Gainem Style by Psy. <laughs> I see I see what you did there, Gainem Style. It's, it's funny, it's funny. 80 lemmings, we can kill up to 20 of them. Wow, this is a nice looking place. We've got that pagoda, we've got some cool structures here. That's not the ja that's not the Japanese flag. That but that's that looks similar. It's white flag with a red sphere in the middle, but there's some more stuff. Okay. Oh, there's a... Oh, I see. There's a hatch that's going to just be dumping lemmings off a cliff. Fun! If you like that. Okay. That's going to be... Tough. So they're going to the... No, is that a splitter? That is... That's, for, that's totally a splitter, isn't it? Okay. That's also a splitter, isn't it? Why does that look like a stoner, then? Or is that slow freeze? Or are those pickup skills? Actually, wait, maybe those are pickup skills. Okay, never mind. I thought that was... Oh, I thought that was a splitter because there was the trigger area and there was the arrow pointing to the left. So it looked like you hit the trigger area and the lemming starts facing to the left. No. Those are pickup skills. Okay... Hmm... This is... gonna be... a thing. Okay, I'm not really sure what to do here. I'm kind of stumped. No, not... Okay, well, I'm gonna try some stuff. So I'm gonna start digging right at the beginning and see if I can dig right into that pickup skill. I'm gonna see if the next lumming down... Okay. So I'm going to crank up the release rate a bit at the beginning to 50. You're going to start digging. You have fallen out. Now we're going to lower it back to 1. This lemming's going to fall out. Uh, actually, that might be too much. No, that's perfect. That's exactly what I wanted. That is exactly what I wanted. So they'll all go out and face this way. He will dig down, get a stoner so we can stone, followed by a platformer in each direction. I think platformer is going to be more useful in the long run than... Uh, I think builders are going to be more useful for uh, this part. Because I'm thinking we can use the builders to get up here, fence, uh, platform, stone, and then uh, build up here and maybe fence up there again. Alright, I think it's all coming together now. Actually... You can bash there, that's cool. And then you can bash here. Again, we can afford to kill quite a few lemmings, which is... surprising. Yeah, okay, that's... So we're going to stone down here. So now you can platform. And you're going to fence up through all of this. Now we do have to make sure we don't lose too many lemmings. Which is why I'm not raising the release rate yet. 
So we can afford to kill 12 more lemmings, which is kind of surprising. I'm going to start building from the flag. Okay, no. We're not going to start building at the flag. We're going to build at this light post over here. No, a little, a little in between the two, maybe. Okay, that's a lot of lemmings that we're gonna lose. We can afford it, but... Alright, excellent. Now we'll we fence up for that. Okay. That's actually... Hmm. I guess one thing we could do, actually, I bet what I bet what we're supposed to do is dig a little deeper. Like I should not have increased the release rate. They would all be trapped up here. I could send one climber over, and then we could bash them out later. Yeah. Stupid old myself. Yeah, this is a much better plan. Yeah. It's better to have one lemming carve the path. Fence up for here. Okay, at this point we can max out the release rate. I have no problem with doing that. Alright. Free builders should get us up here. Now you're going to fence up for this. Now you can stone there. Now we're going to bash these guys out. Now you are going to build, and then we can fence up there and bash them out. Bash the others out. I hope this works. Yep, that should work. Beautiful. Now we just have to time the bomb or the basher, which should be easy. There we go. Okay, that was that was not nearly as bad as I, was, I thought it was when I first took a look at the level. And by bad, I mean difficult. That was actually very manageable. <laughs> Literally, I probably would have solved it really fast if I didn't make the mistake of being like, I'm going to do something smart. I'm going to do flow control. No, you didn't even need to. Oh, but yeah, that was fun. I like that one. Again, not sure if that's really like one of the toughest levels, but that was definitely a fun one to solve. So I, I give that a thumbs up. Level 32, A Whiter Shade of Pale by Procol Harum, or Harum, I don't know, I don't know what this band is. 40 lemmings, we've got to save an extra one. Yes, cloner time. Cloners are low-key one of my favorite skills. All right, let's get on with it. Oh, this is a very, I can't remember the name of this tile set, but it's all black, white, and red pieces, which is kind of interesting. Oh, a very limited skill set, too. All right, well, I'm seeing if we can bash... Well, if we bash that way, we're actually we're going to reach some trouble. Oh, I see. I think I see. Maybe I don't. Hmm. I feel like we need the stacker for this to seal the gap because I'm thinking if we can set if we can stack up this gap, send a climber up, he can dig and bash for all of that.
But we would also need a stacker over here to turn him around, wouldn't we? First of all. Oh, we, a stacker wouldn't even seal the gap. Hmm. Oh, I think I see. Okay. What the crap? You were not supposed to get up that. Let's try this. Aha! Oh, that's... Okay. That's clever. And now what we're going to do, uh, we're going to crank up the release rate. I'm not... <laughs> that's got to be the intended solution. Yeah, now we just dig almost all the way down, and then we're going to bash them out, and they'll go up into this tunnel, and they all go to the exit. Wow, that was... As soon as I figured out what to do with the stacker and the cloner, that everything else fell into place. All right, that was a fun one. That was kind of strange how everything just happened to work out. I'm not sure if I just got lucky and I happened to put the stacker in the exact right place. But that seemed like a very simple level. Maybe it's just because I know the tricks of the trade for, with regards to lemmings. But I immediately saw, oh, if we dig and bash, everyone will go to the exit. So we literally just have to get a lemming up there. And that happened to be what we have, had to do. If that was a back route, like if what I was thinking of would be a back route, that, that would have taken a lot longer. But that was a fun level. Can't create compatible DC. Okay, that happens sometimes. And uh, so basically what that is, is apparently... Some levels use so many, mix so many tile sets together that if you go from one tile, one level that has several tile sets to another that has a bunch of different ones, old Neolemics will crash. So if you exit out and then try again, yeah. Level 33, the house of the rising sun by, this is a traditional song apparently. 40 women's gotta save all 40. Oh, this was the, was it Sweet Helm, Alabama? I like, I like seeing repeats. I really miss uh, so many new Lemmings packs, like, it's just every level is unique, which I get people generally like that, because they're like, oh, sweet, unique levels. I really like it when you can bring levels back, and it's, I especially like it if there are two versions of the same level, and one of and both of them are distinct solutions and distinct challenges. Because I get a lot of people are like, oh, people will just take, like, a hard level they made, give 20 of everything, and make put it in an easier rank, which is what they did with the original Lemmings. All right. Let's see what the, how this is different. Oh, I see. The hatch is over here, and we the exit. Oh, so the exit and the entrance are swapped. Same with the teleporters. That's actually really cool. I really like that. This is going to be tricky to get through. Oh, this is going to be very tricky. Okay, well, there. I'm going to need to find a way to trap them down here. Clearly... Actually, no. I'm going to need Lonesome to go ahead and stack to seal them in. Obviously, we're going to send the glider to be our worker lemming. And then we can bash them out whenever we get the opportunity. Sure hope we don't need the stacker for anything else. Okay, so let's. This is the part where we're gonna try to figure stuff out ahead of time. So we get we get to the teleporter. They go in, they get out, and now we have to get through all this stuff. I think we could dig and bash to get through basically all of these hazards. Build, yeah, we can do that, and then they can go up here. That seems pretty simple. And then they turn around. Actually, hmm. Actually, this shouldn't be too bad. Okay. Oh, pfft. The dog ate me. So we're gonna dig, bash and such. Okay, well, that's a little annoying. Okay. So you do that. Now we're gonna enter the teleporter. Ding! Okay. Now we're gonna dig, and we're gonna bash through everything here. And this is where we're going to take advantage of basher hitboxes. 
Actually, they might just go up through that, which would be pretty great. Whoop. Too far. Okay. They're going to get up to that. Okay. So they do still turn around at this point. If we fence... How about we fence and build? We have no shortage of builders, and we have plenty of fencers. We're not going to need that many. Okay. Yep, they can get up there just fine. All right. Now they go up here. They all turn around. I feel like Strata was too generous with the skill set for this one. Like, this seems easier, again, than the Legend version of this one. All right, now we're going to build. We do need to save a Basher for the begin the guys at the beginning. But that's no problem. All right, he can turn around and do whatever. Then he'll be able to build up to the exit. And now we're going to bash through all of this with them. And it will take a while to watch them go through all of those teleporters. And then you can just build to the exit. And yeah, this... So some of them will go past there, but we can literally just build them out. I'm not going... I see... Mm, I kind of see a problem, but it's not... So I see the problem. If we send... If we have too many guys down there, they won't be able to go for the exit all that easily. So this is where... Builder to the rescue! We still have tons of builders, so... Oh, actually, no. Um, did only two of them go... Okay, never mind. Never mind. Oh, wait. Ugh, there's more. They should still only come through at a slow enough rate that they can pretty much all get through no problem. Okay, well, that's a problem. But seriously, this is very easy. And just like that, we made a bridge that goes both ways. Okay, now we should literally just be able to spacebar our way for the rest of this. Wait for them all to teleport. This is why I don't like using teleporters, because it takes too long for the lemmings to go through. Granted, when you have spacebar, which is just skip 10 seconds, it's nice. But that's that's why when I use teleporters, I like using the maximum efficiency ones, where it's just like... <laughs> as long as they're not all clustered together in like one single spot, they can go through no problem. That was a fun level, though. Again, still thought it was probably easier than the Legend version, or not the Legend, than the Rockstar version of the level, but again, what you gonna do about that? Sometimes that'll happen. Level 34, Purple Haze by Jimi Hendrix. Oh, I'm liking the look of this level. This is pretty boss. 40 lemmings, we can kill up to four of them. This is, uh, I think this is the, just the advanced purple tile set. Is that Splat? That is Splat Height. Okay, well, guess what, folks? We're almost certainly going to... Or, so we're either going to need the stacker or the stoner for this part down here. Or maybe we stone at the bottom and then stack. That's possible. Nope, we're going to need the stoner for down here. Okay, this... Hmm... I have an idea. So we actually are going to need... No, we're not. Hang on. Okay, so there's actually a couple things we could do here. Alright. Start by bombing our way through here. So... I'm going to see if I can avoid using the stoner here.
that does stick out a little bit more. I'm thinking if we can platform from here onto this pixel, then they can turn around and then we can platform again. And then fence at the end when we need to stop. Okay. So actually, I think, I feel like there are actually quite a few solutions to this level that would be valid. Alright, let's see if this will actually work. Sure enough, and then we just fence towards the end. And now all we have to do is platform over that stoner. Wow! Okay! Yeah, that was probably a back route. <laughs> but that works! I feel like... Okay, before before we end the level, I feel like I see two, at least one other solution. Maybe, like, two. Another way you could do that is to potentially stone down here and platform. Or use a stacker to hold them back. Another way you could do it is, again, save stoner at the bottom plus stacker. That would also probably work. Like, if you just stone as soon as... Right before they touch the ground, followed by a stacker to turn them all around. And then you can use some platformer shenanigans up here. That see the Wow. We are just ripping through the legend rank. Holy cow. Is that four levels we've done so far? Oh, let's do a fifth one, then. Let's see if we can knock out... Well, knock it out so it's only five more. Can't create. That's a great error message. Yeah, I think we only have six levels left, and if we can complete this next level, we'll only have five left, and we might be able to finish the final five in the next video. Oh, I'm pumped! Level 35, Scarborough Fair. It's a traditional song. That's the Union Jack. I recognize that. 40 lemmings, we can kill up to three of them. That's a nice-looking building. we got some shadow windows and some interesting steel terrain, and that's an interesting bridge. Sweet, and it's a one of almost it's almost a one of everything level two. That is a floating exit. Well gee, I wonder where we're gonna need the, the platformer. <laughs> Wait, is it literally hang on. I, I it's timeless like these where I wish there was horizontal. Okay, we can bash through all of this and then platform. So it's literally just gonna be about A turning the lemmings around and then holding them back. Okay. Um Wait. I'm missing something, because it cannot possibly be this easy. I am clearly missing something, because there's no way it's going to be this easy. I'm waiting for something to happen. No? Um... What? What? That was, like, the easiest level in the entire level pack. Why was that this late in the Legend rank? Was that back root of the century, and literally nobody who played this level before found that? Or is that a case of the level is so broken you can't possibly back root seal it? I am so confused right now. What? <laughs> that was, that was like, the easiest level in the entire level pack. I think the first level of the pack was harder than that one. What? Uh, I'm confused. Strato, you need to leave a comment, because what? That was ridiculously easy. Well, we're going for another level then today. Level 36. The Phantom of the Opera is here. All right. By A. Lloyd Webber. Uh, 120 lemmings, and we can kill 20 of them. That's a lot of lemmings. This is a beautiful looking level. I love the crystal tile set. The crystal tile set is beautiful. We're going to try this for at least a little, little bit, and if we can't beat it this video, that's fine. The limited skill sets. I'm actually kind of digging that. I am seriously digging the limited skill set levels, actually. It makes them a lot easier. Oh. I wonder, can we turn them around? Probably not, but... Okay, well, we're gonna have to turn them around somehow. Oh, 
Okay. Well, we can use a... a blocker on that side to turn them around. Okay, well that's easy enough. Okay. Now we can we can only afford to kill a, not one more lemming. Okay. Um wait, is it Again, is it literally this easy? We have we can afford to kill two more lemmings. We have a blocker there and a blocker there. So as long as the rest go to the exit, can we literally just platform here? Again, or am I missing something? Or are they not going to be able to get up all those? Nope, they can get up all those. Are you trolling me, Strato? Is the final rank supposed to be the easiest rank? Because what the heck? Either I have backrooted these levels to oblivion, or they are genuinely this easy and you're just kind of saving the pretty levels for last. What? I feel kind of ripped off. I genuinely feel kind of ripped off about that. I I expect tougher levels. That ha okay, the last two levels, those had to be backwards, right? They had to be backwards, right? Because I had a bunch of skills remaining, and they were just laughably easy. But here's the thing. Those backwards were so obvious, how in the world did nobody find those before me? Either I just happened to find these really glaring backwards, or other people found them and they haven't been fixed for one reason or another. But if, if you can't fix them, then why not move the levels to a previous rank? I'm very confused right now. <laughs> I am very confused right now, but I guess we can call that a video. Wow, we solved six levels today. And we didn't even reach a half hour. That's... Wow, that was incredibly easy. I I can't believe it. We only have four levels left, and the last six, le the last like twenty levels in this in this rank have been incredibly easy compared to the last rank, which is kind of strange. Maybe that's just I'm finding backwards here. But okay, I mean I've had fun playing these. They were they were definitely enjoyable. It's just you know I, for the legend rank. Final difficulty rank, I was expecting it to be really tough. So that's it for today, everybody. Thank you so much for watching. I'm Colorful Artie. Next episode will almost certainly be the final Legend video. And unless some, one of these levels gives me, like, an insanely difficult time, I will probably finish the last four levels in the next video. Worst case scenario, I can split it up into two more. But look forward to that next time. Until we meet again, my friends, have a great day, and God bless.